Well, wasn't that job something? I got fired. 21 times. Why? I was rude to the customers. And how did it went? There was that ugly looking slug creature who ordered a big amount of bag of chips. He's gonna become the biggest fat ass soon. There was also that blue haired boy who wanted to buy three watermelons just for a stupid experiment. Like, who would do that? At least that deer who was running out of money didn't do anything to make me angry. That's all. So, I got fired from Kroger. Where should I work next? I know. I'll get a job at Applebee's. Welcome to Applebee's. How may I help you? I would like to order the Southwest Chicken Bowl and the Devil Glaze Baby Back Ricks with chips and artichoke dip and a Mountain Dew please. Sorry, but order less. That's a lot of calories for you to be eating in one sitting. Take either the Southwest Chicken Bowl or Double Glazed Baby Back Ribs out of your order and order something else. Ah, uh, no thank you. I'll stick with what I'm getting. I'm perfectly in good health. Nope. Take either the Southwest Chicken Bowl or Double Glazed Baby Back Ribs out of your order. You don't need that much all by yourself. Hey now. Stop telling me what to do like you're my dad. I'll say it again, I want to get a Southwest Chicken Bowl and Double Glazed Baby Back Ribs now. If you have a problem with that, get out of here right now. You're the one with the problem. I'm going to a different Applebee's. Welcome to Applebee's. How may I help you? I would like to order a classic bacon cheeseburger with mozzarella sticks and a matcha red sangria please. Excuse me, but that order has meat. Too much meat is bad for your health and your muscular strength. Get something else that isn't related to meat. First of all, it's gonna take a while to get fat after eating meat. And second, I'm not muscular, I'm just a skilled boxer. Can you give me my order now? Nope. Get something else or get nothing at all. Fine. Then can I order a Topsy Erlen instead? Oh no. No 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 no. That also has meat. Choose something else to order. Oh come on, you can't tell me how my health is and not give me my order to begin with. I may as well just stand there and keep asking you for my order. I don't care. And it's not like you standing there is gonna make it any better. So stop describing your shocked face and leave. You know what, I'm through with this. You're lucky the rest of the Digital Monsters isn't here, because we will kick your ass. Hard. Welcome to Applebee's. How may I help you? We would like to order. A clubhouse sandwich with some fries. Yum yum yum. No Quaxley. We're not here to buy that. It's Sprigatito's turn, remember? Oh right. Sorry. Anyways, we would like to order double crunch shrimp with fries and a Sprite please. Wait a minute. I just realize, you're the new and ninth generation's starters, like Fuacoco, Sbrigatito, and Quaxley. Right? Yeah we are. Is there a problem? Are you serious? Of course there's a problem. My hatred of Pokemon still stands as if this year, and yet I keep running into ones right now. I know that. And there's no deny on that. I'm not getting you guys orders because I hate Pokemon and that's final. So just deal with it. Wait, did you just say you know? Yes he did. You're not the only one who hates Pokemon. There's that kid in a mohawk and a rock star attire who also hates Pokemons as well. He is a punk. Okay, I don't know who he is, and I haven't seen him as if today. We would say you both have something in common, but a simple question is. When did you start at Pokemon and why? I used to have a job at Target. That's where I saw Zeriwaru twice but he's now with Litten, and the part that I got attacked by both when I roasted him about the toilet cleaner joke. Another story is that I met Ash Ketham at Starbucks, then way earlier I met that yellow fox named Jolteon who I did a little prank on her. Okay, we have nothing to say about that. But Ash was kind of mad at you for something. He also said that he first saw you at IHOP with his friend named Pikachu. And I don't know Jolteon yet, but whatever prank you did, that wasn't nice. Well, it was kind of similar to that. But have you guys seen them lately? On holidays, Ash went to go cool down for a bit after what happened. 
and as a yellow fox you mention, I think I first saw her at the eye doctor when her eye was red from all the spice. The yellow fox was Jolteon, and you just described the details as if you know who that fox is. Hey, we just didn't know her now that you said it. Comes to think of it, you're probably the one who Ash told us about. We would tell you why, but we don't want this debate a little too stray from the straight and narrow. I don't want to talk about what happened between here and now. So get out of here. Well, thanks anyways. We're going to a different Applebee's. Welcome to Applebee's. How may I help you? I would like to order a classic broccoli alfredo with a diet coke please. And I would like to order a BBQ brisket taco with some water please. Okay. That will be $3,900. I'm sorry, but we don't have enough money to get that much. Martin, you just had $6,000 in your wallet just last week. What happened to it? Chris, you're gonna kill me for this, but I give all that money to have Eve when I lost the bet to her when she beat me in a scavenger hunt. Why Martin? Why would you do that? You could have just unaccept the challenge instead. Could have you thought about that since we moved all the way here? Um. Well. Maybe. No. I need to get out of here. Get over here. You're not leaving out of this one. Well, that was something new. Welcome to Applebee's. How may I help you? We would both like to order chicken tenders plate with classic fries and two mango smoothies please. I'm sorry, but we're all out of mango smoothies at the moment. Choose a different drink or come back when we have more smoothies. That's not true. We can see the other employees blending mangoes in the blender. So they're making them. No. That's just mango flavored lemonade, not the mango smoothie. Dude, they're not making mango lemonade. Otherwise it will be ridiculous to put ice on it. So it's the mango smoothie. You're just seeing things. They're making lemonade, not smoothie. Leave it at that. We're not seeing things. We're telling the truth. Shut the hell up you pussy. Hey, don't you talk to her like that. Oh yeah? What you gonna do about it? How does telling on your boss sound? No. <laughs> Agent Trout. How dare you be rude to the customers. That's it. You're fired. Get out of this Applebee's now.